So I had this image just lying around this morning here in Tupunungoi, which is our library. And so I had kids of all age coming in and they, you know, I didn't put a lot around, a lot of t context around it. It was just lying there. And so it was really interesting the way the kids responded because one of the boys came in and he was straight away like, oh, who's that pirate? And so we kind of unpacked, why did he think he was a pirate? Oh, he had his pirate hat on and he's got his pirate sword. And so we, you know, opened it up to really talk about he, why, why is he dressed that way and, and what's the story behind that and you know it's those informal conversations that sometimes really spark off um, some really great discussion and one of the little girls came in and she was giggling because he's um, his you know his privates were painted red and that's really crazy and it was so funny and um, you know, and someone must be really annoyed with him to do that um, and actually one of the older kids came in and said oh he, initially he thought that the red was part of the original statue and it was an artwork that was making a statement about this person. And then, um, and then I told him a little bit about what it, what it was about and he said, oh, his final comment as he walked away was, oh, blood on his hands. And um, yeah, the power of an image like this to to make very quick connections, even just through, you know, through really quick conversations is pretty cool.